eating steak, eat a big old steer and steak, eat steak, do we have one beer, eat beef, 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 it's a mighty good food, it's a great day, we will not have one. Hey guys, welcome to another edition of Black Matt's Black Legion Blog. Here we are, um, Saturday before the Paddle for Salvation tournament. On the uh, 9th and 10th, or yeah, I'm pretty sure it's the 9th and 10th, I don't really care <laughs> specifically what day it is, but uh, next Saturday and Sunday. Anyway, so the purpose of this video is to showcase some of the things that I've gotten done lately and to, to show um, why I've, I've picked the World Eaters Army um, to represent the Space Wolves that I had. I, I could easily have used my Black Legion, it's much more well painted. It's not as thorough, this is a more cohesive army. Everything's done to a a specific level the same level is what I'm trying to say um, it's not like one model is done outrageously well and then another is like half-assed needing completing that is really the main reason well that and I wanted to showcase and I wanted to show um, people at the tournament and uh, I'm getting my commission business going so I'm gonna try and keep the momentum that I have right now uh, going so I want to show everybody like if you buy an army from me uh, you can use it as several different things I'm very 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 thorough in how I construct these armies and as long as it's a power army pa power armor army <laughs> sorry guys uh, you can you know you can play it as counts as you know if you've got your little soapbox to stand on well then just stand on it and we won't worry about it but um, when I focus down on these guys um, I'll explain some more of the things that I've gotten done and what I am, am and am not going to be using here uh, in the tournament next week. Okay guys, I know the camera's going to be shaky, but um, this is it is what it is. I don't know what, really what, what else to say. The things I got done this past week, I got all the Havocs done except for two that are coming in the mail. I got this scout squad done and um, I got this guy turned backwards for a very specific reason. This one right here, uh, because I I put berserker heads, ooh, excuse me, on the front of the guys to make it look like they're wearing masks. Um, and I'll skip up over here, see him. Okay, but then I got this guy turned around and I, I got that strap painted on the back of his head to you know make it look like a mask. Um, things I like this scout squad because I don't know if you can see, but I've got um, individual squad markings. I did a little bit of freehand, and I got these you know. They look cool. I like them as scouts. I'm thinking, I'm giving serious consideration about taking out the lone wolf that um, Lord Zufor, the Forge World Marta, represents in order to include another unit of scouts. I really love, I'm a huge fan of showing up in the backfield with either Chosen when I play Chaos, which is most often. Um, I'm also, so I'm a huge fan of the scouts. They're even better. Uh, these are the Thunderwolf Cavalry that I got done this past week. Um, you guys remember this guy right and I've got five of them um, and the reason this would that that guy right there was one of the main reasons that I was seriously considering using the Black Legion uh, to count as Space Wolves um, I like the models they're very well done uh, they've all got individual style and another thing is that there's five of them I wanted to play five uh, Thunder Wolf Cavalry I think brother Captain James he pointed out that I could get rid of you know if I get rid of one <clears throat> excuse me, one troop choice, it's Rhino or it's Razorback, and then move some points around, I can get another scout squad, because I'm taking out the Lone Wolf, and um, another two Thunder Wolf Cavalry. And these guys have been, you know, they're, they're shot magnets. They're great. <laughs> it, you know, it depends on how you're rolling. Bolters could take them down. That'd be great. You know, if you're rolling, you're bad. You're rolling bad. But well, anyway, we'll see. So moving on over, that's the other scout. I can't tell with this shitty little camera what's in focus. Uh, but... Each squad has got independent, individual squad markings, and I've got up on the Havocs. There's nothing special about them, not really. So, okay, then here I am left with this dilemma: is whether what I'm going to do next week. What is it that I'm? Am I going to finish? I'd like to work on this guy. See, I've got these guys. They're all painted red, um, and I liked him in black with you know little highlights here and there um, in red. But I'm thinking he's going to go red. I'm not, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. We'll have to wait and see. Um, so then you've seen the scout or the squads. No big deal. Well, anyway, guys, that's um, this week's progress and what's coming up. We'll see.